broadening the minds of secondary students through language. A new Korean class is being introduced at Logan Park High School thanks to recent government funding to promote Asian languages in schools. The funding also allows both Japanese and Mandarin Chinese classes to grow within the school. And Head of Languages teacher Barbara Fitzsimons says the school's in a good position to facilitate the classes. With the ability to have the video conferencing as well, we can make up classes because you could have a student from anywhere in New Zealand joining that class. So it's, that's a really um, advantageous thing to do. Fitzsimons says the scheme enables students to learn the languages they want to. And many are seizing that opportunity, including Year 12 student Ava Straw one of the first to put her hand up to learn Mandarin Chinese. It's a language that is growing more and more in a global, in a global sense. And so I feel that learning it would be, first of all, extremely useful. And also, it just looks like so much fun. Like, truly, it, it, it's a really fantastic language to learn. While at Logan Park, Straw is also learning French. She says languages are a good way to learn about other cultures as the world becomes increasingly globalised. And Mandarin Chinese teacher Dr Ling Zhang agrees, having seen her class numbers increase tenfold as students become more aware of China's world influence. They hear um, the word, the name China, Chinese nowadays much more than before because if you go to some supermarkets or like warehouse and you see products made in China. So kind of like exposure is there. Zhang says learning Asian languages is far easier than people first think despite having to learn new characters. A theory that will soon be put to the test when the city's high school students are offered additional language options in the new year. Ruby McAndrew, 39, Dunedin News.